have so much to be grateful for. That I we do. I feel like we should celebrate. I think so. Yeah, exactly. Today was an amazing day. Exactly. That was very... Uh, Let's cap it off with some Jesus juice. Yeah, there you yeah. go. There you go. So to keep the holiday cheer going, <laughs> go. let's talk about the official beverage of Christmas. I love wine. To help us is the founder of Psalm Select and one of 300 master sommeliers in the world. Please welcome Ian Cobble. Thanks for having me. Thank you for coming. Absolutely. I'm excited. I, I love anyone that brings wine. How much can you teach us in four minutes? <laughs> uh, you're going to be an expert. You know, he's already matching Thank the you. wines, yes. which I'm, I'm, I'm super impressed. Born okay. to purpose. So t today I brought two wines. One's from the Cote de Nui in the heart of Burgundy. So Burgundy, that's the color you're actually wearing. It, mm -hmm. it stems from the color of Pinot Noir. It's from the heart of the southeast of France mm -hmm. between Lyon and Dijon. Mm -hmm. uh, the one in the left glass is more earthy, more old world. Okay. On the right glass is a little bit more fruity, but still really balanced. I know you love I like California fruit, yeah. Pinot. I do. Uh, but let's go ahead and taste. My favorite is French, but I like Which California. one do we taste at first? Which so, old right or new? Let's go ahead and let's go ahead and hold both classes. Okay. So let's go ahead and tilt them away from us. You have a white background, so. Oh, don't waste any. You can, okay. You can, ideally, I recommend holding by the stem when you're holding oh, by the stem. Oh yes. You're not actually. If you're holding by the by the yes. bulb, you can. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so you can tilt your glass away from yourself, and you can tell okay. the wine has kind of. What color does it, does that look like? Is that more purple or more ruby? You think? I mean, I would say ruby. Yeah, I would, I, would, I would agree. Okay. So let's go ahead and swirl the glass. I'm seeing blue. <laughs> <laughs> so the old one, we're going to go old. Let's, yeah, we're going to taste the oh, old wait, world so wine you're, first. You're, you're shaking it up. So let's, like, why do we swirl? Why do you guys think we swirl the glass? Just to break things up. Exactly. Just to, yeah. So we're trying to volatize the actual liquid and make the actual compounds that you can smell go from liquid into a that gas. That's going to be my answer. And, Exactly. Yeah. You're, you're that smart. That was going to be my answer. I just wanted you to look smart. <laughs> right yeah. on. So when you're swirling, even though even those at home, imagine the base of your glass. You're kind of swirling around the outside of a circle. Okay. How you doing? Swirling around the outside of the Kevin. circle. Kevin. Look at you, like pro. DJing. You're like wicked, wicked. <laughs> okay, that was, can I taste that it? That was now? supernatural. Not 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 yet. You got to calm not down again. You got to calm down a little this bit. This is the worst so let's, foreplay. Let's, okay. <laughs> <laughs> This better be good. All right, so let's go. Better ahead. be good in so, game. So is anybody like you go out to dinner? Everyone's like the wine has nice legs. What is oh, that? What I does think that you mean? Say that it's how it falls, <laughs> right? What, is it, what does it mean when the wine has the nice legs? Yeah. <laughs> it's funny. I remember when I was in Paris and someone asked me that. Same <laughs> <laughs> I was in Paris. So typically, typically when you see, you know, you're at a dinner party and everyone's yeah. like, oh, beautiful legs on the wine. It simply means how much alcohol pretty much is in the mm. wine. So if you see legs oh. that are coming down very slow, oh. it means there's a lot of alcohol or maybe a lot of sugar. I think I'm about to drink Carl Lewis because it's a lot of legs. <laughs> All right, so uh, let's it? let's go ahead and taste it. Oh, good. So when you taste it, don't just don't just drink it. I want you to kind of chew the wine slightly and expose chew it to it. all of your taste buds. Yeah. Chew it. Not usually at a dinner party, but now we're gonna do it. <laughs> There's lots of salivation going on. It's weird. It took away all the saliva and then it just infused it back. That was exactly. like a trick. And it's finishing it's up, and you get all this kind of almost feels like you're you're kind of tasting the rocks of the soil, yeah, which is nice. kind of unique to Burgundy. And you want food with something like this. Yeah, so I want food So think about, think about like duck or roast chicken or something like that, even All Thanksgiving right. or Christmas dinner, okay. things like that. I like that. It's, it's, it's so, you know what it is? You know what it is? <laughs> it's as if I'm home, but I'm in a cabin, but I still want to lay in a bed. <laughs> okay, without you getting too emotional about this, let's move on to the next let's, one. Okay, okay, next one, next one. Well done. It's good. Well, wow, I'm impressed. It is so good. So second wine, similar color. So this is coming from the New World. Again, from <laughs> so the New cool. World, you're looking for more fruit forward characteristics. Let's okay. go ahead and swirl the glass and smell it really fast. You're getting it's more lighter fruit. lighter to me. So I'm smelling Kevin, it Kevin, now. Kevin, what are you seeing on that site there? Is that... I'm not seeing any legs, I tell you that. <laughs> so yeah. This or... is the one. <laughs> yeah. This one's mine. Yeah. You're New World. Yeah. So, I'm yeah. Old World. So this is this is Oregon Pinot Noir. This is from the New World. For yeah. me, the price to quality, if you're looking for a great Pinot Noir, Oregon produces some incredible wines. This is all organic, small production wine that you That's won't cool. see organic. in too many uh, too many stores. Yeah. But yeah. wait, you actually have a special surprise for Kevin. I actually yeah. do. Yeah. What is it? Somebody call my wife. Tell her I'm coming home active. Did somebody turn? <laughs> Yeah. 
Mix it up. Yeah. <laughs> did you turn 40 this year? I did turn 40. Are you 1979? Yes, sir. So I went to my friend's property up in Spring Mountain, uh, and I brought a bottle directly from the cellar for you. Uh, so this is something that you can enjoy this year. I know you've had an incredible year, or you can save it to your 50th. Holy cow. And uh, this is directly, literally, from the old deep cellars of Spring Mountain that's Vineyards. Wow. Yeah. And, that's uh, so nice. you know, So this is a property that's above St. Helena. Have you been to Napa before? Yes. So above St. Helena, it's this beautiful property up on the steep hillside. And for me, this is one of the great wines of the world. This is 1979. That'll this bring a tear to your eye, no joke. Thank that's, you, man. That's, that's for real. That's, that's one of the. Real. This is one of the most rare wines of the world. That, that. Uh, All right. Well, know, we're... just enjoy it with some of your favorite friends and family. That's it. I yeah. want to get drunk with you. You're funny. Oh my <laughs> we're god. Up here, we're up here drinking all this wine, but we can't leave the audience out. So, Holiday Elf, come on out here with your happiness. Cooper's Hawk Winery and Restaurants is giving everyone, well, everyone 21 and older, a gift card for their signature 12 Nights of Christmas Advent inspired gift box. It's all for so Each night, one of the 12 most popular wines are revealed. This exclusive and seasonal gift is available only on their website and restaurant locations nationwide. I will not stop talking until you subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's right, and I can talk a lot. Seriously, not gonna stop. Yep, still here, not going anywhere. I see you. Don't walk away from this.